Hey y'all, we are Sounds Like Nashville, catching you up on everything that happened this last week in country music. Let's get you caught up. NBC's The Voice is returning to its 21st season with a fresh new look. Coaches Blake Shelton, Kelly Clarkson, and John Legend will be joined by newcomer Ariana Grande. Set to return to primetime on September 20th, the Emmy-nominated competition will air on Mondays and Tuesdays. Don't miss your chance to see country music's next rising star. The iHeart Country Festival returns to a live format for 2021 after converting to virtual concerts last year. Hosted by Bobby Bones, the event will celebrate its eighth year with performances by artists Blake Shelton, Toby Keith, Little Big Town, and more. Don't worry if you can't make the event, as you can watch along live on all iHeart Media Country stations and iHeartRadio.com. Country superstar Keith Urban performed in the opening ceremonies of the Tokyo Olympic Games today. He joined artists from around the world in a pre-recorded performance of John Lennon's Imagine, arranged by composer Hans Zimmer. The opening ceremony also featured a fireworks show, a parade of the world's best athletes, and more. TikTok has highlighted the new country music talent. James Bear Bailey went viral for singing at his local gas station. He has posted a series of videos of him nonchalantly singing a cappella to some popular country hits as he checks out with a cashier. These videos have caught the eye of other country talent like Mickey Guyton, who have gone on to spread these videos around social media. With covers like Keith Urban's Till Summer Comes Around and Travis Tritt's Best of Intentions, we have put together a list of his best country covers. To view all of his performances, visit our website. Dolly Parton had a big week. According to her long list of achievements, the country icon has scored two Emmy nominations for her 2020 Netflix Christmas movie, Dolly Parton's Christmas on the Square. Her show will compete for Outstanding Television Movie and Outstanding Choreography for Scripted Programming. The 2021 Emmy Awards will air live on CBS and Paramount Plus on September 19th, so tune in to see if she adds two more awards to her accolades. We have a lot of new country music for you this week. Starting off... Jason Aldean and Carrie Underwood joined forces for our new duet, If I Didn't Love You. The powerhouse team collaborated on the track for Aldean's upcoming 10th studio album. Cassidy Pope released her new music video for her song Say It First, and we have the exclusive premiere ahead of the worldwide release on our website. Don't miss your chance to see it first. Another voice winner, Jake Hoot, released a summer anthem with his new song Night Left. Scotty McCreary released a new heartbreaking track with Why You Gotta Be Like That. Grammy-winning songwriter Emily Weisband teams up with Little Big Town's Karen Fairchild for their new duet, Butterfly. And last up, Miko Marks celebrates her American roots covering the classic Long Journey Home. Those were the top stories of this week in case you missed them. If you liked the video, please leave us a like, subscribe to our channel, and be sure to click the bell to be notified when we release a new video. And if you want to stay up to date on everything around country music, visit our website at soundslikenashville.com. Sign up for our daily newsletter while you're there. We have these stories plus new ones every day, including new music, videos, sweepstakes, and more. So check it out. See y'all next time.